Did you zoom it back? Yeah, I did. Okay. Hey everybody, my name is Benson, and today I'm going to be talking about something that I found interesting in a few of McJournal Nuggets videos. And I'm going to be doing a compare. I'm going. To, I'm probably going to be comparing these these kind of videos and how they're similar, and also how a person says they won't do something, but later on they do it. So in the video, in this one video called that McJohn Nuggets made was called Custody Battle. That was during the Psycho series and that was made in May 2016 and basically you see Uncle Larry and Psycho Dad having an argument and Larry just literally drops the F-bomb and later on eventually Psycho Dad will say like shut the F up. But uh, yeah like during that argument I mean Uncle Larry didn't have his glasses on, he didn't have his hat on, he had a green shirt on and Psycho Dad had a black shirt on. And let's just say, you know, like Uncle Larry was going crazy. He was going ape crap on the Psycho Dad, you know. Cussing him out, you know. And Psycho Dad barely even dropped the F-bomb until, like, maybe until when he told Larry to, like, shut the F up. That was when he dropped the F-bomb. But then what, there was a video this year. Well, yeah, this year, on the, in the month of July, at the near end of July, called I Am Everything. That's part of the 2017 series. That Major Nuggets is currently making still. Those guys are loud. Anyways, um, so basically, in that video, Uncle Larry comes in, wants to talk to Psycho Dad, and he basically wears the same green shirt, but he this this time he has the hat and glasses on, and this time, Psycho Dad is the one who drops the f bomb. He's more pissed off than Uncle Larry is. In in the video custody battle, they were both equally mad at each other, but Psycho Dad wasn't dropping the F-bomb like Uncle Larry was. This one, Psycho Dad was really dropping the F-bomb. Yeah, I just had to come inside, you know, coming upstairs for a minute. But anyways, uh, but then, in the video custody battle, when Psycho Dad and Uncle Larry was having the argument, you know, Psycho Dad was asking what he would do if he had to take care of Jesse, and Uncle Larry was like, I wouldn't go and destroy people's shit. I'm sorry for the language. Well... It's only one bad word, but I'm not going to use too much bad words. I mean, unless something pisses me off, but... Yeah, Uncle Larry said he's not that kind of person. But in other videos, like Psycho Uncle Impact's Fool or Psycho Dad, uh, I think, destroys TV. It's basically where, like, you know, Uncle Larry is mad at Tom for not helping him out. And Tom is just there playing video games and, and not paying attention to Uncle Larry. And... Uncle Larry basically destroys the DV. Well, what does that have to do with the two videos that I'm currently, like, um, matching, like, Custody Battle and I Am Everything? Well, I mean, in Custody Battle, I mean, Uncle Larry made a statement saying that he doesn't, he wouldn't go and destroy people's stuff, but then, later on, in Psycho Uncle Impact's Fool, or Psycho Dad destroys TV, I think we'll see otherwise of Uncle Larry. Oh, and he does, oh, and he drops the F-bomb in those, in those videos as well. Let me, let me show you guys what I'm talking about when I actually put the videos. Ah, let me just show you guys. Come with me. Okay, so here are the videos that I, were ta that I was talking about. So you got this video, I Am Everything. And you got this video, Custody Battle. And you got this one, which is like a bonus from Custody Battle. And the reason why that's involved is, well, I'll explain why in a minute. But anyways, uh, the first video I'm going to explain is, well, Custody Battle, which was made in the Psycho series, which everybody knows. So, um, basically what happens here is, and I just wanted to show the picture, so similarity, you see like how Psycho Dad is kind of close to Uncle Larry, and then you see in this video, he's the same thing, he's close to Uncle Larry, but this time he has his hands on Uncle Larry as well. But let me just show you something, alright? Let me just show you something, alright? So in this video, in this video, you know, Psycho Dad and Uncle Larry are having an argument, right? But guess, but guess what? Well, you, I already explained it. Uncle Larry was cussing... He was just really, he really dropped the F-bomb, let's just say that. Let me show you. Yes, yes sir. You didn't teach him shit. The only thing you teach him all the time is just how you can fucking destroy shit. That's all you ever teach him, all the time. It's See that? You show do. him a lesson. That's bullshit. You oh, is it? Lesson. Yeah, how the fuck do you teach him? How do you do it better? What do you do? I don't fucking destroy people. Oh shit. boy. But what do you That's the ironic part. Yo, I'll, I'll, I'll get to that in a minute, but uh... Yeah, so you hear, you see them yeah. too. It doesn't matter. You show them love. You show your porch. They're having an argument, as you, you can see. And you see, Uncle Larry is using dropping the f bomb more than Psycho Dad does. That's why he's always running away 
from you, right? Oh, he's running away from me? He's running away from you every fucking time you turn around, isn't he? And then, and he come? He come pretty problem. much, yeah, my problem. Problem. It is your then, then after the argument, things start to happen. Like, Uncle Larry, like, in this video, so Uncle Larry in this video is, like, I don't want to say he's yelling more than Jeff was, but he was cursing more. He was dropping the F-bomb more than Jeff was. The only time Jeff drops the F-bomb is, well, after he shoved Larry against the wall. Let me show you, okay? After I show you more of this argument. Let me just show you. Show him love or anything like that. The hell I do. He's had all the you love in the world. Time you showed him love. You don't show him fucking shit. You know. Who the hell are you to tell me what I do? Oh god. See that? Go ahead and hit me, man. Surprised he was. Uh, surprised Corn was. Uh, allowed to be as close to Uncle Larry and Psycho Dad as he was because like I don't know how none of them like one of them never said like Corn turn off the camera you know like get that camera out of my face you know stuff like that but anyways hey I'm not gonna hit you I'm not that kind of person so um, yeah you see how Psycho Dad's kinda close to him and he's like that too and you know another thing similarity is that Uncle Larry wears a sort of light green shirt. His shirt's lighter than Psycho Dad's shirt, and Psycho Dad wears a sort of black shirt. And this kind of video, I don't know if you can see it that well, but Psycho Dad wears a dark, pretty dark shirt, and his shirt, and Uncle Larry wears an even lighter green shirt. So I now, what does that have to do with anything? Possibly nothing. I, I'm just kind of weird that way. I just like to make a comparison because in both of these videos, Psycho Dad is the one who gets in Uncle Larry's face. So let me show you this one. Alright, the part where Psycho Dad drops the F-bomb. Pack your shit up. Time to go. Why so aggressive? Yeah, gotta go. Shut the fuck up, Larry. I'm his father. You're not. How about, how about you shut the F up, alright? And learn some respect. That's if, if Psycho Dad was really psycho. But then, now we get into this video, and this time... <laughs> Psycho Dad drops the F-bomb more than that one time he did in custody battle. In both of these videos, he he, he, he pretty much wins the battle against Uncle Larry. But let me show you this one. He gets way more aggressive than he did in custody battle. Let me show you. Video? What, are you going to be their father figure again? I don't even understand what's He'll drop the F-bomb in a minute. There's always a video going on here. And it's always about me or some stupid you fucking losing. shit. And Larry's involved Listen. with it all the time. You heard that? Your videos, your videos now, and now his videos. Just He's coming over to hell. He's just doing what? Your attitude. Yeah. But why? Come why on. not? Serious. I mean, come on. It's you not know. serious. Do you know where have you been for six fucking months? I've been right here. No, you haven't. The if hell he has it. What has he done? Him? What has he done? What? He's held what have I done? Knife to a fan's throat. He's held your sister and my wife. He kidnapped her. Then he's fucking doing drugs. Then he put a fucking gun to my fucking face. So what the hell? But that wasn't him. That was Isaac. This is Jesse we're talking about. Yeah, so I'm pretty much... In that, in this video, a little short argument between Uncle Larry and Psycho Dad. Uncle Larry isn't so mad in this one like he was in custody battle. Like, another difference between that and this video is that Uncle Larry didn't have his glasses and hat on. You know, like, in that video, he had his glasses and hat on. I am everything. But in this one... Hold on. In this one... Sorry if it's so blurry. You don't fucking show him love or anything like that. Just give me a second. Hold on. See, in this one, he has no... He has no glasses on or hat on. And he was more aggressive. This time, he's less aggressive. And he does have his glasses and hat on. Again, just uh, just kind of my, you know, thing. But anyways, uh, <laughs> and so here's where things really get. Into, well, no, maybe I won't show that. I don't want to show too much. I just pretty much wanted to show, like the t the times, you know, where you know these were. It it was. I feel like that between this video and this one, you know, like Psycho Dad's on one side and Uncle Larry's on the other. If you can also see another. <laughs> So pretty much what I'm saying is that the, the, the same thing between this video and the uh, between this video and the other video, I am everything, 
is Uncle Larry's on this side and Psycho Dad is on the other and he and he and he wears a green shirt and Psycho Dad wears a black shirt so technically Psycho Dad's shirt is much darker than Uncle Larry's shirt which again you know it's just sort of like a little weird thing that I have but anyways uh and in this video pretty much the same thing and sorry if this picture's brighter you know when Parker turned the camera around I just sort of paused it where the camera just had to focus on Uncle Larry but this, in this video, pretty much the same thing happens. Uncle Larry's on one side, and he wears a lighter green shirt, like where his shirt is lighter than Psycho Dad's shirt, and Psycho Dad wears, is on this side, and he wears a darker shirt. <laughs> and now, yeah, so I'm basically, sorry about that, yeah. So basically, that's a, the only difference, well, not the only difference, major difference between this I Am Everything and Custody Battle is that Uncle Larry was having a pretty well argument with Psycho Dad, and it's, and in this one, Uncle Larry was just pretty much calm. Like, well, he he did raise his voice a little bit, but not but not as bad as how Psycho Dad raised his voice. You know, you should have more respect for your taste. You're asking Jesse to have respect. You know, and you know, in the video, you know, just to point something out. Okay, wait, do, can I turn this off? No, no, not yet. Hold on. I know this is off track, everybody. But man, you know, Parker, you had to chase Parker around, didn't you, Psycho Dad? You know, Parker had to go through enough. Do I, I have to mention that he, that Je that Isaac shot Parker with a gun? Do I have to mention that Parker got yelled at by so many people and to see you chase him? Only because why? He has a fucking camera. Is that why you chased him because he has a camera? Is that why you had to go and chase Parker around? Let me tell you something. If I actually saw you doing that, you wanna know what I do? I. <sighs> Sorry you had to see that, everybody. Uh, but uh, the point I'm making was, you know, like, so when Isaac took over Jesse's body, he was pretty much threatening Parker. He would yell at Parker. Sometimes he'd tell Parker to turn off the camera. And he would, you know, like he would threaten Parker with a knife or a gun or something. And I, I thought Psycho Dad would have Parker's back on that, which he did. But now he gets on Parker's ass. He starts threatening Parker, chasing him. Looking like he was about to attack him only because he was filming? You should be on his side, Jeff. Like, you shouldn't be against him. You should be on his side. But, uh, that, I'm, gonna, I'm getting off track. So now, we get to the part. This, so now we get to this part. And, uh, you know what, let me just, let me just show you something, alright? So, in this video, in this argument... Here, hold on a second. In this video... So in this video... You know, where Psycho Dad and Uncle Larry have the argument. This is something that Uncle Larry says. I don't fucking destroy people's shit! Uh-huh. Yeah, and then, a while. And then, a couple months later, like, hold on. Uh, damn it. Press something. See, I, I guess I had it on this thing as well. That still worked. This was made on May 15th, 2016. And this video was made on August 5th, 2016. So almost three months later... This is what he does. And there's also going to be another video I wanted to show you, which I'll get to that in a minute. But let me show you this first. That's bullshit, Paul. Is it, Tom? Why don't you just get some fucking jobs done here? All you got to do, I mean, I don't make you work all fucking summer, right? Every year, right? All you got to do is, like, what? A few chores. That's it. But for some reason, you can't do it. And then you mm -hmm. got to come home and get all pissed off all the time. Just do them. Just do them, Tom. Well, I mean, I'm right in the middle of a match right now, so I'll do it. Oh, really? So because you have to play video games, then you can't even help your own father out. Sorry. And then this is what happens. This is what happens when Tom said that. Watch what happens. See? Oh, oh boy. See? Now, how about you do some work, Tom? Huh? Oh, okay, yeah. Does that motivate you now, Tom? Sure, just let me get my shoes That's on. kind of a threatening way of doing it. And he didn't even mind the cameraman. Fucking time I turn around. So, yeah, and uh, if that's not enough for you guys, let me let me show you something else. Wait, what? Oh, I'm not mad, everybody. I'm, I wasn't mad. I was just in my raid face, all right? I don't know why he had to film. Anyways, but now that you're filming, let me show you something else, alright? So, if you, if that wasn't enough proof, if Psycho Dad destroys TV wasn't enough, although that was pretty obvious there, but let me show you, because I'm pretty, because everybody would argue and say, like, well, Tom provoked that. I mean, it's a skit, everybody, but 
realistically, they would say Tom provoked it. But let me show you something else, all right? You see this? Watch what happens here. Wait, I don't want to show the title just yet. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So you say you don't destroy people's shit, huh? Oh my gosh. And then, yeah, so there's Jesse. He's freaked out because Uncle Eric crashed into the pool. And then this is how Psycho Dad's like. Oh, hold on a second. Let me see if I can. Get that piece of shit out of my yard. That's how Psycho Dad is like, yeah, what a great friend you are, Mr. Ridgeway and Uncle Larry. Because they did say before that he and, he and Uncle Larry were friends. But here's the reason why, I, I think there's a reason why Uncle Larry did that. I don't know if he explains it here, but... So here's Jesse struggling to get him in the hospital, well, in the car. Yeah. Hold on. Are you with it? Come on. Please. Come on. You okay? You breathing? You good? Are you good, Uncle Larry? Uncle Larry! Fuck. Fuck. Dad! Yeah, that's sure as hell it's gonna... Dad! Yeah, that's sure as hell it's gonna get him over there. Fuck. Okay. Fuck. Fuck. I don't know. What'd you do? What do you do? What do you do? Hold on. Wait, he's breathing. He's breathing. Uncle Larry. Uncle Larry. Hey. Hey. Are you... Oh, there he goes. He's almost in the Come on. We need to get you to the hospital. We need to get you to the hospital right now. Come on. Come on. You good? You good? Say something. Say something. I'm all right. You good? You good? What the fuck were you thinking? It doesn't, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Come on. You stand. You stand. You good? I can, I'll try and carry hey, you. Hold on. It happens in a minute. We get you to my car. We get you to my car. Yeah. What the fuck were you thinking? Yeah, what were you thinking? Now, why'd you turn off the camera? Well, because I feel like I need to give it a break, you know, like, we, we didn't get to the part just yet. Alright, well, you know what? This is why Uncle Larry says, you know, to pretty much sort of prove why he did what he did. <laughs> yeah, so that's pretty much proves a little bit, you know, why he did what he did. He wanted it to be over because, I guess, the feud between him and Psycho Dad just wasn't over, alright? Let's just say that. And then, but then there's another video of the real reason why he did what he did. And I'm gonna show it to you right right about now. Well I have to find it, but I'll show you when I'm when let me just give this right, alright? Let me let me let me get the other video. Alright, now you can turn it off. Alright. You wanna know the real reason why Uncle Larry destroyed the pool? And now I'm back, yeah I'm ready. If you wanna know the real reason why I did it, listen to this. And he says if Corn didn't have the camera on and Corn said no and literally Uncle Larry was looking at him with the camera and I guess he just thought it, he was just holding it. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, now I'm ready. So the reason, so here's basically the reason why Uncle Larry did what he did. Yeah, so let me, let me show you why he, let's just say, impact the pool. Let me show you. When you told me that your dad was out by the pool, I wanted to kill him. I think he deserves to die. So, yep, so that's your reason. Now, I know that's uh, com that's kind of completely off track of me comparing two videos, like the custody, like the custody battles, and I am everything. But I just thought, like, when I did, when I, when Uncle Larry in custody battle mentioned that he doesn't destroy his people's crap, you know, then there's a video called Psycho Uncle Impact's Pool, where he basically destroys Psycho Dad's Pool, and then there's a video... After that, even where he destroys the TV when Tom when exactly listen to him. Now Tom provoked that in that one, but in Psycho Uncle Impact's pull, you know that's just sort of taking it to the next level. Let's just say. Oh, and there's also you, you know what? Screw it. There's another video I just wanted to share, even though I'm specifically kind of not allowed to, but just for reasons I don't feel like explaining. But you know what? Let me show you another just one more video. Here's one more video that you thought Uncle Larry may have not been, that you thought that you might have missed. That I know I missed, but let me show you. 
Psycho Kid Crushes PS4. This is another video where Uncle Larry, let's just say, went destructive. Let me show you. Holy shit! <laughs> Dang, why not? Yeah, give it a little finisher. This soda man. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, baby. Woo! Another one. Yeah, so this is pretty much where Uncle Larry went destructive. So, um, and that was even way before Custody Battle was even made. So, um, <laughs> I mean, I know it was probably a one-time thing for Uncle Larry to do, because I know it was probably a one-time thing, you know, but, like, after Custody Battle, Uncle Larry changed to do a, He only did that out of revenge, you know, because cause I guess Jesse thought that Jeffrey deserved to have his PS4 destroyed, so that's what he did, and Uncle Larry decided to join it. Oh, yeah, I know why, because Jeffrey pretty much, I think, burned Jesse's couch, and he burned Uncle Larry's side, so for revenge... They destroyed Jeffrey's PS4 and they're high fiving it. And this is how Psycho Dad would have reacted if he act was there to actually witness that. Why do that to Jesse too? Hold on. Let me show you how he would have reacted. John fucking shit, you know. <laughs> That's probably what he would have done. He probably would have been a lot worse, but yeah, that's just a little old joke. Anyway, so, so um, I hope you enjoyed this video. There's a lot more added in here than I thought there was. So I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And like I said, I know some videos it might it might be confusing to you to you. All right, so, um, so basically, I I guess you could say I might just call this title like comparing three videos or from a jar of nuggets or you know something like that. I think that's just, I'm just gonna keep it simple, all right? And maybe I'll put down and more, you know, like comparing three videos and and with parentheses with with more videos or something like that. I'll, I'll think about it if when I put this out. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And yeah, all right. Well, I'll see you guys later. And like I said, I know some of it might be off track, but you know, I just some some of them I just added there just you know just because I wanted to add them there. But yeah, all right. Have a good day, everybody. Alright, see ya.